Hi everybody, Goldbook here. Welcome back to Shadowlands Redemption episode 3. Today we are going to see all the changes I've made to our little hobbit hole. Hope you enjoy. Hey guys, just thought I'd bring you in for a closer look at the changes that I've made. Here is the bee farm. Really enjoyed making this one. I'll leave a link in the description to the tutorial for making the farm itself. But yeah, I just prettied it up with some flowers, some azalea bushes and just tree beehives and yeah not a bad result let's get some candles going hopefully Oh, 
And next I just made some little farmland and put threw some paths in to try and make it all look a bit nicer. Moved the cows and sheep over to their own little pen over here. And yeah, tried to do a custom tree. Um, I'm kind of happy with it. I think it turned out okay. Hopefully I'll get better the more I try and do. But yeah, it's not bad. Then we take the path down this way um, brought it over and I made the stairway up so that we could get higher up into the mountain. As I was clearing land, the trees up here, I came across this natural uh, tunnel that cuts through the mountain and came out a little bit higher up. So I decided to make it into a cool little cavern, cave, um, walkway. Really like this. And now that we've opened up a bit of the mountain up higher, hopefully soon we can make some new bills up here. And also um, inside the hobbit hole, I redecorated, made a little couch seating area, got my own enchantment setup done, which reaches level 30. And upstairs, I made a little nether war farm and a little mini storage area with all, some of the workstations that you would need. Um, and I was mining and I came across a zombie spawner and found this disc, which I have never seen before. And all I say is the music is pretty cool. I like. I think that's enough with the music. <laughs> so yeah, that's a cool disc. I like that. Down here, I loved the glass floor so much that I wanted to extend it out uh, further over the ravine so we could see more of the mine shaft, which I think looks pretty cool. And decided it would be a great spot for my nether portal. So I popped that in and I'll bring you through to the nether and show you how we arrive. It's pretty weird. No nether portal here. Instead we spawn in a soul sand valley. Yikes. So I was quickly ready to safen it up got fed up of getting blown up multiple times uh, yep as you can see plenty of gas so we followed down here and we have a little drop down to get it out down into the hub it brings us out as rebel and summer's portal and here we are at the post office check see if we have any mail Yay! Oh, thanks so much, L. Yay! Now, quick 
build here we're going to make a melon and pumpkin farm um so enjoy the time lapse bye